breakfast in the morning around 9 o'clock and uh, I have my first class for sports media at 9.45. From there I'll go on to work out because we have workouts on Monday and Wednesdays and then I'll get a quick shower in, do my stretches, get on the ice early, get some shooting and stick handling in, have our practice and then after our practice we go upstairs for our, our uh, post-practice meal in the club room. From there I go to my tutoring from 4 to 5. And then after that, uh, we usually like to go to sushi on Wednesdays with the guys. And then from there, just go back to my apartment, lay low, and then go to bed. Take a trip. Find some friends. Find a seat. Find your power animal. This is awesome. So is this. And this. And that. Have a beer. Start a fight. And make everyone wish they were only in Minnesota. breakfast in the morning around 9 o'clock. It's kind of difficult in the morning before practice to get a lot of food, but nutrition is one of the biggest parts in your day-to-day uh, -day basis. Yogurt with eggs. That looks good. I have my first class for sports media at 9.45. They make it easy for us to um, get our classes done in the morning. I really try to run their academic week Sunday to Thursday. Um, we also do our best to avoid classes on Friday if possible. Anything that we can do earlier in the week um, is helpful. Our goal is to really be proactive and do things on the front end um, and get ahead in the week and get ahead in the semester. All right, time to work out. For the college schedule, games mostly Friday, Saturdays. There's a lot of practice time Monday through Thursday. You also get to lift consistently Monday, Wednesday, or twice a week, and that helps with the development and growth process. Look at that speed. It's like DDR. With me personally, it's helped me take strides and strength and balance and certain weaknesses that I had coming in here. It's a bagger, actually. Yeah, that was tough. Uh, obviously, if you want to make it to the next level and uh, you want to become a better hockey player, you got to put in hours to, to become better. This year especially, um, I've asked Grant to, to come out before and help with like me, and Leon comes out a lot. He's helped me tremendously with just uh, getting my shots off quicker, helping me out with my shot in general and stick handling. The coaches are always willing to help you, and it's just uh, whether you want them to help you or not, you just gotta reach out to them. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't ignore such a passionate call. He can't, I want the one piece. I did. There's definitely times to be serious, definitely in games and stuff, but uh, when it comes to practice time, it's definitely a, a part of my game just, just to kind of relax and have some fun. Watch, you shoot again, look at this guy. Yes, he didn't shoot it! This guy's nuts. Uh, it's fun to joke around with them. Yeah, I was giving Leon and Stevie some crap about what they are doing to each other, and I think it was funny because they were just firing back. Yeah, there's nothing for you to chirp me about. He's chirping you. Did you hear him chirping? Hey, you won the argument with Leon, hey? Yeah. You got it. Hey, Doc, you won the argument with Steve. Huh? You won the argument with I Steve. I think I did. Yeah. I do too. After our practice, we go upstairs for our, our uh, post-practice meal in the club room. They're making sure we have uh, good fuel in our body for, for the rest of the day in order for our, our body to recover. You're, you are what you eat. You are what you eat. From there, I go to my tutoring from four to five. They definitely give us the resources and tools to get good grades. It's just uh, how motivated you are to, to get those grades up. Skins, what are you doing? All right, well, good luck. All hockey players will meet with a mentor tutor their first semester. We do that so they have somebody to, to work with, make sure that they're on top of their studies. Vinny is one of those students that is going to put in any extra effort that he needs to. He is one of the rare students that has requested mentor tutoring even after it's uh, no longer required. So it's been fun to watch Vinny work hard and do well in the classroom as well as on the ice. We usually like to go to sushi on Wednesdays with the guys. I always try to help out my friends who don't know how to use chopsticks. And you just lay that one in, and it's just like that. 
He's trying to teach me the, the whole chopstick thing, which I still obviously have not gotten the hang of. At the end of the day, Shior is either just stabbing the sushi in the middle with one chopstick or using his hands. I need a better teacher, I guess. For us freshmen this year, is huge because all the older guys went great, including us and, and whatever everyone's doing. We pretty much hang out every night. You just have a different bond when you're away from the rink. You're not just thinking about hockey all the time. It's just that bonding time you get with the team. You never know how long you can play this game for, and so you just got to enjoy it while you're here.